The smallest doubt can destroy the greatest confidence. And we all have doubts. Messinia. Quite a beauty, isn't she? Get to the point. I know what happened in Dima. How Natakas died. Are you brave enough to hear the truth? I want to know everything. We saw no one at the beach that day. No Natakas, no child. They had escaped. Or oh, so we thought. Until we heard the cry. It was coming from a ship, wrecked on the shore. The soft but unmistakable cry of a child. Elpidius. There was nowhere to run. Natakas tried to resist, but it was futile. The baby was all that remained. I will find Amorgis. I'm sure he would expect you to try. What do you want from me? Our stories are written by a rare few who have the power to shape them. It's not every day I can speak to someone like you. There are no absolutes, Cassandra. Not even with tainted ones. You are fireborn with the potential to destroy, but also to warm, to cast a light in the dark. A warmth you try to destroy? People die, Cassandra. Eventually we'll all be forgotten, fading away like a distant dream. Our actions, however, if they're meaningful, will be remembered. Tell me, what do you want to be remembered for? I can't let you live. Not now. Not ever. We are what we choose. I will live and die by my choices. Know this. You cannot stop the order. Even in our deaths, we live on. We are everywhere, now and in the future. It was a pleasure to meet you, Cassandra. What do you want to be remembered for? I want to be remembered as someone who helps others in need. Hmm, insights. Such wonderful insight. Thank you. And now we must part. The question is, will you allow me to live with my life? Leave. Before I change my mind. Your baby, Elpidius, he is safe. That much I can tell you. <sighs> it was a pleasure to meet you, Cassandra. The next time we meet will likely be the last. Natakas, Elpidius, I'm sorry. We meet again, Nigelbearer. You know this can't end well, Yeris. Just walk away. It's not that simple. Amorgis has orders and I have duties to fulfill. And I have no intention of walking away, Cassandra. After all I've written about you, learned of your feats, I know I can't defeat you. Yet, I cannot simply stand aside. We both have our reasons.
Through me, it's Bersia. Make it through me, and the Morgus awaits you in the temple. Morgus is using you! Don't be stupid! We don't have to fight! I do this of my own accord, and for my duty and devotion to Persia. The will of Amorgus has nothing to do with it. Your loyalty to your home and commander are admirable, Yeris. But the Order has no place in the Greek world. Everything the Order has done, everything I have done, has been in service of a cause greater than any individual's. So, all the deaths and suffering, that is justified? For the greater good, Cassandra, all things are permitted. You're mine! Didn't have to do this. 